Ground control. Okay. So in this case, we don't have ground control here. We don't have an airport tower. So what we're going to do, we're going to do what's called self-announcing. So I'm going to be making a number of radio calls as we're going through. And that's just telling other airplanes in the area where we are. And that's how we, you know, when we're at an airport like this where we don't have a tower, that's how we all keep ourselves safe, is just telling each other where, what we're doing. Okay. Yeah. Taxi. Okay, so we're going to start our taxi. Angel Fire Traffic, Saratoga 624 Delta Papa will be taxiing to runway 35 via the taxiway. Angel Fire Traffic. So what I'm going to do, I want you to go ahead and put your feet on those pedals. And at the very top of those pedals, see that metal part? Yeah. Those are brakes. And so in just a minute, I'm going to ask you to give me a brake check. All right, go ahead and push those pedals. <laughs> okay, Quinn let off. Now brake I'm gonna, check. So. I'm going to check my pedals. All right, I checked mine. Mine are good. Gonna give them a wave as you go by. All right, and then read off the rest of the uh, checklist for me there. Um, atometer. You said it before, but so altimeter. Yeah. So what we're checking is is that it's just sitting still and it's at the right position, which it is. Okay. Vertical speed. That's this device right here. This tells us how fast we're going up or down. Are we going up at 100 feet per minute? Or are we going down at 100 feet per minute? And, we, and since we're sitting on the ground, we want that to be zero. Okay. <clears throat> so in this case, we're just checking to make sure that's the case. Okay. Heading indicator. Heading indicator. That's these that we both set. And we're making sure that as I move, you'll see I'm making little bitty turns. I can see that those are moving. Okay. I'm just checking them. Airspeed. Airspeed indicators right here, making sure that it isn't showing any kind of weird fluctuations or anything like that. Okay. Turn slash bank indicator. That's this guy right here. <clears throat> You'll watch what happens with the little airplane in this as I make a turn. Oh, I see. <clears throat> so I'm just checking to make sure that's working. Okay. Proceed to run up. Okay, so we're going to proceed to run up. So you'll notice I'm not holding this. Those rudder pedals are actually connected. They're on the tail, and they're uh, the big vein that go like this on the tail. But they're also connected to the front tires. So as we are uh, doing this, I'm actually steering the front tire with my toes. Oh, okay. Throttle. Throttle to 2,000. Mixture. Okay, let me get the throttle up here. So I'm looking at this instrument right there. 2,000 RPMs. Okay. Okay. Magnetos, L and R. Okay, so magnetos, I've got two ignition systems. I'm going to check each side. Ignition system one. I turned it off, and it drops a little bit. Okay. I turn it back on, it goes back up. Now we're going to do the same thing with the other ignition system. Turn it off, and it drops a little bit. But when I bring it back online comes up so both ignition systems are working all right so what we're going to do here is we're going to get lined up okay i'm going to go ahead and bring our throttle up my feet are on the brakes mixture goes rich i'm looking for 35 35 inches of manifold pressure okay Turbo charger's working. We're good to go. All looks great. Here we go. Okay. Go ahead and pull your... There you go. Airspeed is alive. 40. 
and the higher the winds are, the worse those bumps get. I don't want to take somebody up their first time whenever it's all going to beat you to death, so that's why we got out a little early today. So when the, the sun beats down on the ground... Hold on just a sec. I'm oh, sorry. Go ahead, the 624 Delta Papa. 624 Delta Papa, we are been informed that there is a uh, birthday girl on the airplane. We are calling to wish her happy birthday. Roger, thank you, Center, for that. Appreciate it. You want to say hello? Hi. Uh, have a great flight. Uh, so you're going to just click on this button right here? And right say, now? Yep. Say, thank you, Center. Thank you. There you go. <laughs> that was air traffic control calling us to let you know happy birthday. Oh, thank you. Oh, I didn't hear. <laughs> I was saying, Callie, as the, the sun heats up the ground, you also get temperature rise, and that causes a lot of those bumps, too. Oh, so yeah. you'll go over a, a plowed field that gets hotter than a green field like grass, and you'll actually feel the difference of the, the different types of terrain. You get over a lake like this, and the air is nice and cool below yeah. it, so it doesn't give you a lot of bumps. Yeah. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to make one more turn here, awesome. and I'm going to put the dam out your window, so what I'm gonna, I'll try to show you what the dam looks like from up here. All right, now it's your turn. What? <laughs> Go ahead and put your hands on the yoke and put your feet on your rudder pedals, okay? And I want you to kind of follow along with me for at first here. Okay. You'll see it doesn't really take a whole lot, but it takes a second for when you make your move and it takes a moment for the airplane to react to what you're doing. So. Get, get it set here nice and level. Okay, it is your airplane. Okay. So, go ahead and give us a, a slight left-hand turn. There you go. We'll just hang out going this way for just a moment. Okay. Now you'll notice our nose is going down a little bit. Pull back on your yoke some. There you go. And let's go ahead and level off a little. Nice. And now we're now our nose is a little bit high. So if you push your nose forward, there you go. And you kind of want it to be just even on the horizon, even on the mountains there as you're looking yeah. around. Now let's go ahead and make a turn and go over here to the right a little bit. We're just going to head up the valley some. All right, we can straighten out at that big mountain. That's what we want to aim for. Go ahead and bring us left a little bit. Nice. Well done. Thank you. Can I let go? You can. Oh. Go for it. And if you want, the other thing is, is give your right foot a little push and watch what happens to the nose when you push your right foot down. Push a little harder. There you go, a little harder. There you go. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're going to make our right turn. You'll get to see it right out of your right wing there. And here we go. There's a ski area, there's a town. Alamosa traffic, uh, station 17, Romeo pops to 20 miles southeast of the field. We'll be landing runway 20. That building right there on the right? Yeah. Maybe that's that's the cafe. That's also the ski patrol shack. So that's Papa's office in the winter. Oh, yeah. Right there on top. Yeah. Oh, it's a cool town. Yeah, I'm very good driver. Go find 18, 14, 35 miles. Sending out a 16,000 landing Durango. Yeah. Angel Fire Traffic, Saratoga 624, Delta Papa is 15 miles north of the airfield. 
We'll be uh, doing a low approach, runway 17, continuing southbound, Angel Fire traffic. So I'm going to pull our Telemosa traffic citation 17, Romeo pops uh, 10 miles east of the field. We'll be landing runway 20. All right, so I'm going to pull our throttle back a little bit. That's going to let us lose some altitude. Okay. And uh, you can probably see the airfield out there now, about 15 miles out. Angel Fire traffic, Saratoga 624 Delta Papa is on a four mile final. Low approach, runway 17, Angel Fire. With our runway, you also got to look down it to see if you see elk or deer, <laughs> and you may have to go around again. To <laughs> yes, and I have had the elk on the runway before. <laughs> Yee -haw. Wave at him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go see if we can find uh, Grandpa's place over here. Yep, they're off to the right. The gray garage and the house oh, yeah. and the rock. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> We're out waving on the patio. Yeah, that's David. Oh. <laughs> Those low wings give you a nice ground effect. Yeah, they do. <laughs> and with this runway, you can just tweak it in there, easy as you want to, you know. Angel Fire Traffic, Saratoga 624 Delta Pop is clear. Runway 17, taxiing to parking Angel Fire. <laughs> 